so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great so in this video i'm going to show you how you can take the transparent background render using the blender and i will also show you how you can take the render with shadow and without shadow something like that so now let's start the tutorial so here you can see guys i have a simple setup here and i have a one uh, cup of tea okay so before taking any render you need one camera because without camera you can't take any render so make sure you add one camera in your uh, scene and after that you can set your camera angle and i'm just going to keep this plane beside for a while because uh, first of all i'm just going to show you how you can take the render without background so for that you have to go to your uh, render properties so after that you have to click on this film option and here you will see that transparent so when you click on this transparent so here you can see that overall viewport get uh, transparent and you will see that these checkers on your viewport that's mean it's become a transparent and now if i take the render so that's how you can take a transparent render in the blender but here you can see if i save this file so after save this file if i open this file in the photoshop so here you can see now we have a transparent file and after that i can fill any color so here you can see we have a transparent background but here is one problem we have a transparent background but we don't have shadows okay in the plate you can see we have a shadows but in the background we don't have shadow so how we can take the uh, transparent render with the shadows so now i'm just going to show you so now i will open this file again so and here you can see we have that same file and right now i'm just going to uh, keep this background here and right now here you can see we have a shadows in our background but what happen if i will take the render so that background also will be appear with this uh, shadows and that's we don't want so for that what you can do you can use the shadow catcher so how you can use the shadow catcher so from the um, object properties so after that you have to click on this visibility so after that you have to click on the shadow catcher and make sure this uh, shadow catcher work only in cycle so if you try in ev it will not work okay and after that if i will take the render so now here you can see we have a transparent background with the shadow so if i will save this file and open in photoshop so here you can see guys i open this file in photoshop and right now here you can see we have a transparent background with the shadows so now i'm just going to add the one layer behind it and now i'm just going to fill the color so now here you can see we have a transparent object uh, so that's how you can render the with shadow and without shadow and these setting will work also in a video render also if you take a video render from the here okay and one more tip for you guys uh, sometime you are taking a render but still you get the uh, black background when you save your render so for that you have to go your output properties okay and from here so make sure you have to uh, change this rgb to rgb a so rgb a means rgb alpha okay and that's how you can take the render with shadow and without shadow so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any suggestion please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply your comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys